Hey guys, hope you're having a great day so far. So one of the questions I get is, you know, what do you eat for breakfast and you know, what do you eat on your diet and your meal plan? You know, it's a common question that I get from a lot of our clients and I'm going to show you guys today one thing that I do a lot for breakfast and I'm going to show you a creative way to make it healthy. So one thing I eat a lot of for breakfast is oatmeal. I usually do oatmeal and eggs. Sometimes I'll do some whole grain toasts and eggs, but usually my go-to is going to be oatmeal with some eggs and egg whites. And today I'm going to show you guys a really creative, healthy way to make oatmeal taste awesome. Today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making some banana bread oatmeal. So I got some oatmeal uh, boiling on the stove here. And one of the great things about oatmeal is it's a quick breakfast option. You know, we often think that oatmeal is something that it takes, you know, 10, 15 minutes to cook. But if you actually get quick oats, I'm going to show you guys quick oats here really fast. If you get these quick oats, they take about two minutes to cook and you're all done. So nice, fast way to cook your breakfast. If you're concerned about eggs or egg whites taking too long, if that's gonna be an option for you for protein, you can cook your eggs or egg whites the night before and save yourself some time in the morning, especially if you wanna sleep in and get some extra rest. So for our banana bread oatmeal, we're gonna have our oatmeal that's here on the stove. We're gonna be adding in some bananas. Okay, so I cut up a banana here. So it's one whole banana. We're gonna add that into a uh, three quarters of a cup of oats. Okay, we're also going to add a little bit of natural maple syrup, so organic maple syrup. I'm not going to measure this, but I would recommend measuring it if you do. Okay, so we're just going to add in about a tablespoon of some syrup. Excellent. We're going to add in about an eighth of a cup of walnuts. Okay, we're going to add that into the oatmeal. And then we're going to add some cinnamon. So just bear with me here as I undo the uh, tab on the cinnamon here. So we're gonna add a little bit of cinnamon to the oats. Get some of that in there for some good flavor. And then we're gonna top it off with a little bit of vanilla extract. So again, just bear with me as I undo the tab here. And all of this stuff is gonna give the oatmeal some awesome flavor. You know, oatmeal can be quite bland. If you don't spice it up. And we're going to let that sit there and we're going to stir it up. So guys, literally about five or six ingredients here. So we have oatmeal, we have our banana, we have our organic maple syrup, we have some walnuts, we have some vanilla extract. And we're going to stir this up and we got some banana bread oatmeal. Okay, the other thing you could do if you wanted to make it a little bit sweeter and keep it lower calorie is you could add in some stevia as well. Okay, but the maple syrup is going to be sweet enough in conjunction with the banana for most of you. So if you do feel like you need a little bit of sweetener, okay, you can add in some stevia. And the big thing that I'm going to recommend here with the oatmeal is you want, you want to be measuring out uh, the maple syrup. I know I didn't measure out the maple syrup. I just wanted to do it quickly for this video, but you do want to measure that out because even though maple syrup is healthy, it does still have a lot of calories if you don't measure it out. The other thing you also want to measure out are the walnuts. You know, wa nuts are great. You know, it's a great source of unsaturated fats, but the calories are quite high if you're not measuring out the food. Okay, and then you also want to measure out the oats as well. So three quarters of a cup is what I do. You know, for most people out there, I would say half a cup to a cup of dried oats is going to be a sufficient portion size. So this is the end product here, guys. Looks uh, quite tasty. And I'm really excited to have the banana bread oatmeal. So that's one example of a breakfast that typically is viewed as bland. But it's a breakfast that if you combine some ingredients and you do it creatively, you can make it healthy and you can make it tasty. Thanks so much for watching.